I'm Shelly Badger, and today I'm going to be playing Cat Room Drama. Ten, ten, meow, meow. <laughs> so I enjoyed the previous game of this, the case one, so much that I wanted to do the second one. There's also a third one, so I'm going to get on that as well. You know I'm going to. <clears throat> so let's begin. Hello, and welcome to Cat Room Drama. I'm Patches Bailey. On today's episode, it's the great poop off. Let's check into the courtroom now. This is the plaintiff, Copper. He says he found some poop in his favorite sunning spot and he knows it came from the defendant. And now his favorite spot is ruined forever. He's suing for the right to do the same to the defendant. Copper, plaintiff, suing for retribution pooping. Oh man, that sounds pretty serious. And this is the defendant, Radar. He says that the poop wasn't his and that he wouldn't disturb the plaintiff's sunning spot, but the plaintiff won't believe him. He's countersuing for damages. Radar, defendant, accused of pooping where he doesn't belong, countersuing to actually poop there. <laughs> That's pretty interesting. <laughs> All right! Now, put your paws together for your favorite judge and mine, the one, the only, Judge Dingleberries! Oh man, I really don't like being called Dingleberries. I really would prefer like Bigglesworth or something. You know what Dingleberries are, right? The little poop on, on the fur. Ugh. Thank you, Bailiff Muffin. Is everyone sworn in? Yes, Your Honor, and I've got my spray bottle and sheath just in case. I really don't think that'll be necessary. That plaintiff looks shifty. You'll thank me later. Court is in session! Ahem. So, Copper, you're suing Radar here over pooping in your favorite spot. Can you explain? Yes, Your Honor. I have a favorite spot of mine in our house that I like to lay in. It gets all the best sun, and I'm usually able to lie in it for a few hours before I'm disturbed. It's perfect. I really feel like that was a missed opportunity. They could have been like, perfect, you know? This <laughs> is just me. I'm saying, okay, <clears throat> I'll stop. Where is this spot? Oh boy. Okay, so in the living room, we have a bunch of couches and chairs and cushions, and those are all great and everything, but they don't get as much direct sun. So I actually started tracking where sunlight moves in the room. It took a while to gather up all the info I needed. Did you know it changes with the season? He <laughs> really did spend way too much time on it, Your Honor. I spent just the right amount of time, Your Honor, in order to discover the perfect spot. Perfect! It's actually not in the living room, it's just outside the living room, in the hallway. There's a big enough window, so it's a pretty large spot, but it moves throughout the afternoon, so see, what I did was, I found the spot that will be in the sun the longest. Even though the lights will move, I know just where to lie down in order to catch the sun for the longest period of time. How long does the sunlight last in this spot? Oh, this is amazing, Your Honor. It really is not actually that amazing. He's asking me, Radar! <laughs> I'm gonna stop you for a second there, though. He is not asking you. She is. A uh, meow. Meow, meow, I'm a girl. Meow! All right, I'm going in. It's spray ball time! <laughs> I'm gonna do it, guys. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Proceed, Muffin. Aha! Uh -huh. You heard the judge! Spray, 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 spray! Spray, 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 spray! Ah! Oh no, I'm sorry. You did this. You both did this. And stop addressing each other! Spray, spray, spray! Spray, 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 spray! We'll be good. That's enough, Muffin. Sir, yes, sir! Is the plaintiff usually this high strung? You have no idea, Your Honor. Do you get a break from it? Just when he's sleeping, which is luckily a lot, Your Honor. 
Hey! And I'm assuming something happened to this special spot of yours? Yes, Your Honor! One day I came to my spot and there was a... a thing lying in my spot. <sighs> and what was this... thing? It was poop, Your Honor! Poop! Right on my special spot. My favorite sunning spot. It was just... lying there, soaking up my precious sun. What happened next? Well, I was horrified. I didn't really know what to do. He came over and sure told me about it, Your Honor. Well, that's because he did it. What makes you think the defendant did it? Because who else would have done it, Your Honor? We're the only cats in the house, he means. But what evidence do you have that he did it? Well, it was his poop and he's the only other cat. And I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have pooped in my own favorite sunspot, Your Honor. Mega, I really don't think he has to say favorite sunspot every single time. Like, I'm pretty sure you'd just be like favorite spot, you know? I get it. I get it, dude. I get what you're saying. It's your favorite sunspot. I understand. I get it. Now, time to stop. Time to simmer down. Simmer down now. But you didn't see it happen? No. That's because it didn't happen, Your Honor. So, did you do it? Oh, come on. Copper is delusional and making up stories. He did it. Stop deflecting and answer the question. Did you poop in the hallway? No, Your Honor, I didn't. You better not be lying. You can't lie to the judge. I'm not lying. It wasn't me. He is lying. Your Honor, please. Calm down, you two. If you didn't do it, did you at least see what the defendant is talking about? I did, Your Honor. And you can confirm it was actually poop. Not some old food or something like that? Oh, right. Well, it was poop, but it wasn't as gross as he's making a sound. It's disgusting. What is your problem? Your Honor, it was really old by the time I saw it. It was just this one dried up poop. I mean, this is kind of gross, but whatever. That's still enough to be gross. Wait a moment. It was dried up? Yes, Your Honor. What difference does it make? Hey, I'm asking the questions here. You need to watch yourself, copper. I'm sorry, Your Honor, but this is just a waste of time. Whoa, whoa, whoa there, mister. I don't think you understand where you are. I'm sorry, it's just so frustrating when Radar makes up excuses. It's no excuse. It's not my poop. Why are you so sure that it isn't yours? Maybe it fell out of the litter box or something like that? The litter box is on a completely different floor, Your Honor. There's no way it could have come from that. Plus, it was, well, it was tiny, Your Honor. And it didn't have any litter actually on it, so it didn't come from there. And it was too tiny to come from me. <laughs> Whoa, that's a little too much information there, Radar. <laughs> He's lying, Your Honor. It wasn't too tiny for him. Oh, wait a second there, Copper. How would you know that? Like, how would you even know how much a per like the size of, of a poop that someone else makes? Like, that's, I think you're spending a little too much time around his poop cover. <laughs> a little too much time. <laughs> it was. Do you have any proof then? Photos or anything? I do, Your Honor. I have got a photo of it before it was cleaned up by our humans. <laughs> More photos. I'll take that! Yoink! 
Here you are, Your Honor. Thank you, Bailiff. <laughs> it's all part. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> this is all really cute. <laughs> hmm. I see. This really does look old, Copper. Yes, Your Honor. That just means he has been planning this for a while. Frankly, I find it insulting that he thinks I would do this, Your Honor. He's annoying, sure, but I wouldn't hide away my own poop for months and surprise him with this. Then why are you countersuing to poop on my spot? Because of how much you put me through, I may as well do it. <laughs> I like the way this guy thinks. I get you, Radar. I get you. Hey! No addressing each other! Where did the poop come from? From him, Your Honor. No way. There are no other cats in the house, no other pets. All humans have a tiny human of their own, but it wears diapers, Your Honor. There's no one else it could have come from. I may not freak out about poop, Your Honor, but I also don't like it. I wouldn't have missed, I wouldn't have masterminded this whole thing. Where do you think it came from, if not you? I don't know, Your Honor. It really could have been from the tiny human. Or maybe it was underneath something. Our humans moved some furniture around that week. So, you have a tiny human in your house, too? That's right, Your Honor. And what makes you think that this poop wasn't from it? Because it wears diapers, Your Honor. All the time? Of course. That's an exaggeration, Your Honor. Okay, well, maybe not all the time, but most of the time. Our humans don't let it run around naked and generally doesn't poop on the ground. Your humans were moving furniture around. Was it your furniture? Yes, they were moving furniture, but no, it wasn't ours, Your Honor. It was so annoying, Your Honor. I wasn't able to sleep on my spot for most of that week. They just kept going back and forth, back and forth, carrying stuff around. Do you know why they were moving things around? I'm not too sure. They were moving the town of humans things around, Your Honor. Could the poop have fallen out during this move? What do you mean? Well, if the defendant is telling the truth, and this didn't come from him, could it have come from this move? But he did it! It was a ton of human's furniture, Your Honor, so maybe it could have been. We were both staying away, so nothing could drop on us, so I sure didn't see anything. I think I've heard enough. I'm ready to give my verdict. I have to do it. I'm, I'm not even apologizing for that. I'm just going to own it. <laughs> so, now we have to figure out what exactly should I charge them with. Because, you know, I'm the great judge. <sighs> Dingle berries. <laughs> Alright. Um, well, I do not think that... Radar is guilty. It does quite seem like the tiny human is probably the cause. And Mr. Uh, what's his face? Copper. Copper here. He he seemed so like hell bent to get on this dude without actual general evidence that I, you know I actually feel I'm gonna go pretty firm handed with this one and I'm gonna put not guilty full counter because that's what happens when you mess with the bull. You get the horns. Or in this case when you're the kitty cat and you get the you miss the kitty cat, you get, you get the kitty claws. Rare. So yeah, not guilty, full counter. I find the defendant not guilty. That means no damages for the plaintiff, but I am going to award the defendant their counter damages. Court is adjourned. Dun dun! No! <laughs> Thank you, your honor. <laughs> All right, you heard the judge. Now it's time to... Get out! Move those tails. The court reporter will see you in the hallway. 
And that was the case. Let's hear from the defendant first. Big win for you today. How are you feeling about that verdict? Pretty great, honestly. I didn't expect to actually get my countersuit. I was more doing it just to <laughs> get under copper's fur. <laughs> Does that mean you won't go through with it? Oh no, <laughs> I absolutely will be going through with it. <laughs> and after all that, I need to ask, did you do it? No, I didn't. I never lied about that. Where do you think it came from? Who knows? Well, thank you for your time and congrats on the win. Meow. Meow. Meow, meow. Let's hear from the plaintiff. Not a win today. How do you feel? Awful. This is totally outrageous. I don't know how this happened. I guess the judge didn't think you had proven enough. I don't know what else I could have done. I had a photo and everything. Just because I didn't catch him in the act doesn't mean he didn't do it. Are you going to catch him in the act when he does it this time? My favorite spot is ruined forever. How am I going to get the optimal amount of sunlight now? <laughs> meow. <laughs> and that's all for today. Thanks for watching Cat Room Drama. See you next episode. Aw, I was kind of hoping there was going to be like in the next episode. Uh, well. I hope you enjoyed this gameplay as much as I did. The voices were a little more interesting. I was trying to kind of figure out my way. <laughs> I'm probably going to have to recycle voices sometimes. I'm telling you, I'm sorry ahead of time. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit the like button down below or do a pause up. I, why do I keep making that joke? It's a terrible joke, Shelly. And if you want to be updated on future uploads, then be sure to subscribe. I'm Shelly Badger, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!